Hello everybody, I just want to let you know about how to avoid a, uh, um, an internet scam going on out right now out there. Um, I had received this letter from supposedly um, Dennis Burton uh, representing RGP Customer Research Inc. Um, supposedly it has an office in Broadway, 15 Broadway, New York, New York, 10003. This is a, this is a complete scam. This is a fraudulent check that I received here in the bottom um, that came along with the letter. Um, he was trying to um, tell me that, you know, um, you can be a mystery shopper out there and this is all done, of course, via, via email. Um, I was very suspicious from, um, from the very beginning and really, guess you know what, let's just check it out. Um, I know he was uh, a fraud to begin with because I know he just sounded too good to be true, especially with the compensation was $200 a month, uh, or I'm sorry, $200 a, um, a job per mystery shopping. And I, I already know somebody who's doing some mystery shopping from a very reputable uh, company that I know. And um, just from knowing that, as well as from my loss prevention background and being suspicious in the nature, um, I was suspicious of it. but. I just wanted to um, see how far the dominoes would fall and to see if I needed to be wiring any money anywhere to people and sure enough so let me show you without further ado what the check looks like um, this is the fraudulent check is a cashier's check um, it was um, made out to me and I did not want to really um, show you my name so I blotted that out uh, for the amount of $1,680 and supposedly according to the letter that um, was sent with it is that I was supposed to wire transfer the money to the next supposed person who is a potential mystery shopper. Um, my suspicion of it was for Manila Philippines via Western Union and that is the big big deal. You never want to um, send any wire transfer money to Western Union um, to anywhere especially outside of the country without first talking to a live person and really getting the story and really very um, sure of it and know this person quite well so that is a big heads up you the person the consumer or the person the potential victim are the uh, are, are the biggest um, person to actually stop this or, or, or you're, you're part of the biggest domino piece and if you take out the equation of that by not cashing this particular check over here you can avoid the scam, you can avoid the financial health, you can avoid the financial headache that you will have later on you're dealing with the bank, you're dealing with the police because the bank will get their money back um, unless you have the amount that is um, needed uh, that is you know um, needed to cover this um, you're going to be owing the bank this money um, later on so please avoid it now what I did with this I actually went to a bank a friend of mine and asked, asked them about this and I know in my, in, in my, in my head and the premise in my heart this is a fraudulent check but I have wanted to uh, have a professional verification of it and what they told me and I saw that clearly in there too because I've seen fraudulent checks like this before was the placement, the placements of the, the routing number um, supposedly the routing number of all 40 digits has to match um, with the ones on the bottom and as you can see there's an extra digit here and that's supposed to be the last four digit that matches the, the four digit up here and it's not that so there's an extra digit on top of that so the placement of that the, the, the routing number was wrong the placement of it also was was incorrect um, um, and there's also a check number over here and there was none up here um, so there are a lot of discrepancies to this and but most importantly I also researched the Liberty Bank the, the website itself or their website has a, uh, a scam alert out there in regards to internet scams so before you cash any checks to wire transfer especially for a huge amount please please do your research do not be emotional about having time constraint to send the money because overall it is your money that you are sending them because this is a fake check so please do not fall into that uh, being emotional about it and just be smart about it do your research and the next thing that I did was to Google search um, this particular um, address 815 New York New York and as you can see um, it doesn't seem to look like a um, 
um, a, reput a reputable research company um, in New York and this is very suspicious to me so I did not follow through with a lot of the things especially the uh, cashing of the check so um, do your homework do your research do not get emotional and do not cash that check before you have it all professionally checked out just go to the bank and just say hey you know um, I got this in the mail there's a letter that came along with it I'm very, very suspicious of it I think it might be a fraud uh, could you please check it out and that's what you need to do and the, any bankers out there whether you bank with them or not will be more than happy to check that out for you and tell you its discrepancy of those checks and so that you can avoid the scam you can stop the domino which is you are the um, the, the big domino piece in this the biggest one so that um, you know that the, the person apparently Dennis Burton um, is going to be riched by you and so you don't want to fall by that so um, without further ado if um, anybody has been victimized by this scam before I apologize if you've um, just you know um, saw this this uh, post of mine uh, after you've you've been falling victim of this and I apologize there are ver please report it to the police if you have been victimized please report it immediately to your bank um, well the bank's gonna contact you anyway whether you know that the check is is fraudulent um, and you owe the money um, so you have to work with the bank about how to uh, to rectify this uh, you can also go to um, ripoff.com and um, and place a, a report out there in regards to this very things. There are so many reports in regards to this RGP uh, research company, Dennis Burton scam. So it's a huge thing. Please do this for your own financial and reputation and own peace of mind and health and mental health. Do not do this. Do not cash the check period until you get it professionally verified okay that's all I got take care